Chevy Equinox 2.4 liter Ecotec. Let's change the oil. Going with some uh, Valvoline full synthetic advance. Dexos approved. And this is our EC Delco filter. This will cost you like right around $35 to do with decent oil and a decent filter. Here's everything you're going to need. Some ramps drive up on. 3 8 wrench with 13 millimeter. Uh, half inch drive with swivel like this, like about a foot long. I think it leaves an inch and a quarter. Yep. One inch and one quarter. This is to get the uh, filter cart cartilage out. And then obviously you want some type of uh, pan to drain everything into. So let's go ahead and get this on these ramps. This thing's still going strong at 220,000 miles. Jeez. If you never got something up on ramps, I'd suggest having someone help you. Like mine, see, a little dangerous, but it'll be okay. I got cardboard down. I don't have, I have a creeper, but I'm not using it. But when you're underneath here, you might have a tray or not, but this is your oil pan. You're going to go further back. It's here. This is the bolt we need to get loose, 13 millimeter. I don't know if I'll be able to do it in the first try or first take on the camera, but... Yep. Took a few hits, but it is off. We'll get this drain in. Let's see how much oil we get on us. Let's see, we just, just pull out method. Not that much oil. While that's draining, we're gonna go up top and get the filter. I like to pull this back so whenever it gets less and less, it's not gonna be on the ground open this and it seems like it always drains a little bit faster with that off then you just pour it all in and we're ready uh for the filter it is a little tricky you got to somehow get that socket in through this hole like in through right here so i gotta do it two hands i can't do it I try to get on the camera but somehow some way you gotta pull those wires back and get that in there like i said it's a uh, very tight you don't have much room but got it and you're just gonna sit here and slowly work this off and it is very frustrating because this socket will pop off at the, because of the angle and everything just put it back on there and keep trying eventually you'll have it off that's a good time to compare your parts unfortunately this didn't come with an o-ring so this one's not too damaged or that old i'm just gonna have to run it again and I guess check my box next time I go to buy uh, one at Walmart. Uh, usually these uh, AC Delco ones come with it, but I guess not. So we'll get this slammed in there and then get that stuff poured in and show you guys how to reset the oil life on the dash. Don't be brave, get a funnel. This is $1.25 at Dollar Tree. It's take five quarts. Oh my God. So fill her up until this thing's empty. Where's your menu button? Yeah, sure. Scroll through to options. You want to reset? Yes. 100%. There you go. And that's how you change your oil in a Chevrolet Equinox. You're good. Always check your leaks when you're done. We're good to go. Don't forget to put your uh, drain plug in when you're filling it up. But uh, yeah, please like, comment, subscribe.